of Williams. High punt and Jackson just on his side of midfield and he'll get wrapped up and taken down by Calvin McCarty. But good field position for the Rough Riders with 36 seconds remaining in this. Welcome to Sports Center. The Eskimos can clinch a home playoff day with a victory over the Riders. They could also finish first in the West with a win and the Lions' loss on Saturday. Second quarter action. Eskimos driving down 7 0. Catches 46 yards last week. Here comes the blitz. Ray over the top. He's got Bowman. Foot race. Adarius Bowman. Touchdown. 71 yards catch and run ties the game at seven apiece. Meanwhile, Jerome Messam coming in just 19 yards shy of a thousand for the season. He eclipses the mark in the second quarter. Messam becomes the first Canadian to run for a thousand yards since Sean Millington back in the year 2000. Two plays after that, Ricky Ray spots Bowman crossing the middle. Bowman breaks a couple of tackles, stretches in for his second touchdown of the game. 24 yards, 14 7 Eskimos at the break. Third quarter we go. Beloved Riders coach Ken Miller retiring after Friday's game. The Riders looking to send him off with a victory. Ryan Dinwiddie gets out of the pocket on this one, pointing for his receiver Dallas Baker to move. Baker can't get open. Dinwiddie has to go out of bounds on the play. And on the way to the sideline, Baker gives Dinwiddie a shove. The teammates would have to be separated, clearly not agreeing on that play. Baker on the field for the next Riders possession. And check this out, Dinwiddie. Looks for him, but it's picked off by Rod Williams. Riders down 17-10 after three. Still a seven-point game in the fourth, under three minutes to play. Dinwiddie to Chris Getzlaff this time. 20 yards, his second touchdown of the game for Getzlaff. Ties it at 20 apiece, under two to go. Eskimos driving, Ray. Over to Bowman for a big game. Bowman over 220 yards receiving. Same drive. Derek Schiavone with a 27-yarder for the go-ahead. That would be good. Eskimos up 23-20, opting to kick it off. Jackson on the return. Weldon Brown strips him of the ball. He ends up bundling. And that's all she wrote for the Edmonton Eskimos. They will be hosting a postseason game back at Commonwealth Stadium. Very exciting for Edmonton fans. Messam, in all likelihood, will finish third in the N or third in the CFL in rushing behind only Brandon Whitaker and Corey Boy Boyd. Meanwhile, Adarius Bowman had just two receiving touchdowns all season coming into the game. The Eskimos haven't hosted a playoff game since 2004 and haven't hosted a Western final since 2003. They've also had to wait for the Lions, as we mentioned, that going tomorrow. Welcome to Sports Center, everyone. Kate Burness alongside Jay Honoré. I'm still very distracted by your mustache, by mm. the way. Distracted because you're delighted by mm, it. Maybe. Uh, 